She was renowned for her beauty in ancient Egypt. And today, CBS 11 photojournalist Mike Kenny takes us inside the Kimball Art Museum for a look at the new exhibit, Queen Nefertari's Egypt. These are beautifully painted coffins. They depict this journey that the deceased must make uh, through the underworld in order to reach the afterlife. We are in Queen Nefertari's Egypt. Of Ramesses II's uh, eight wives, Nefertari was his most favorite, the one for whom the sun shines. He felt that she was so beautiful that the sun had to rise every day to illuminate her face. Part of the exhibition also explores the discovery of Queen Nefertari's tomb. This happened in 1904 by Ernesto Schiaparelli, who was then director of the Museo Egizio in Turin, and that is where all the objects in the exhibition come from. And what's so extraordinary about her tomb is that when he discovered it, it was one of the largest tombs in the Valley of the Queens. So the entire tomb is painted with wonderful murals that depict the perilous journey that Nefertari must take through the afterworld. When he discovered the tomb in 1904, it had already been plundered in antiquity. So um, most of the precious materials have been taken. But of the few things that were still remaining, we have a pair of palm sandals that she may have worn. It's one of my favorite things in the exhibition. And there's also a pair of mummified knees. Another component of the exhibition is the artisan village of Deir el Medina. From there we have wonderful things, objects of daily life, also the tools that they actually used to build the tombs. I think there is something here for everyone, uh, not only stepping back in time to visit ancient Egypt, but it's um, visiting Italy and the Museo Egizio, so it's a really great opportunity. Now, the exhibit will be on display through March 14th, including a virtual tour on the Kimball's website. The